Hey everyone, my name is Justin and in this video I'm going to show you how to create a time-lapse video with the Canon G7X Mark II. Alright, so turning on the camera, the first thing you want to do is set the dial to the video mode right here. Now in the video mode, you're going to be able to click on this corner here and choose between different modes. So standard video, manual, or time-lapse movie. So you want to select time-lapse movie. Now in the time-lapse movie, there's a few settings you want to set before you shoot the time-lapse. So if you press this button right here, we could set the movie settings. So the shooting scenes that they offer are one, two, and three. And these are just kind of some default presets. So shooting moving subjects is scene one. And you notice that's two seconds in between each shot and 150 shots. So that means we're gonna need five minutes of recording to come out with a six second time lapse. Now within scene one, you can adjust the interval from between one second to four seconds between shots and you can also adjust the number of shots so for something like a sunset that's going to take like 20 or 30 minutes let's select scene two which is going to let us shoot at a higher interval so let's do five seconds in between each shot and let's do 300 shots so it's going to take 25 minutes and we're going to come out with a 12 second time lapse to view. So let's press OK and then you can go back to the menu and now the next step is to go ahead and find our shot and frame it. So if you have a tripod that's going to come in handy. I'm going to use a tripod. However, if you could place it on a ledge or some other secure way to get creative with it, you could still create a tripod that way. You just want to secure the camera so that you don't touch it while it's shooting. So the nice thing about the G7X2 is that it's got this articulating screen. So if I'm working low to the ground here, I can flip up the screen and see what my shot looks like before I set it up. So once you have your frame set up how you like and you're sure that you're on movie mode and also time lapse mode and you have your number of shots and your interval set up how you want it, one extra precaution you can take is open up your menu and in the seventh menu you can set a self timer so you could set it to two seconds so that way there's no shake when you're pushing it on the first shot it's kind of an extra step but I'll just use it in this case and once you're ready to start the time lapse just press your red record button I've got the two second timer going on and you'll notice it'll start taking those shots at the interval that you had and it the cameras in eco mode right now so it should get a little bit extra battery life but you want to make sure you have enough charge to last however long you set your interval for so in this case at my interval that was going to take 25 minutes now remember don't touch the screen at this point or move the camera unless you want a moving time lapse but any movement you make will mess up the frames and you'll see it in the final result. All right, so once the camera's done, it should make a beeping noise and go back to the regular menu. And from there, all you gotta do is press the playback button and you should have it in your playback or your memory card. So let's see how it turned out. Alright guys, so that's basically how you create a time-lapse video on the Canon G7X Mark II and some general tips on time-lapses overall. So hopefully you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, definitely leave a thumbs up. If you had any questions or comments, feel free to leave them below or find me on social media at Justin Odisho for more. Thanks so much for watching and I'll see you guys next time.